guys welcome back to my channel today is a Friday the 19th and guess what today was my last day of work so now I am officially done working which is really sad because I won't be able to see my children that I love and I made an attachment with or my co-worker friends that I made a great bond with I graduate next Saturday on the 27th and I have to pack up this whole apartment this next week so I'm going to try and film that I hope that I can stick with it um, but yeah I just went to Trader Joe's so we're just gonna do a little Trader Joe's haul and then I have to babysit in a couple hours so I'm just going to relax and then until I have to babysit so I have the laundry going so please excuse that some tortilla chips because I do have salsa that I need to eat up before I move and tortilla chips I bought a box of waffles because I have syrup that I need to use up. I bought these oatmeal cranberry dunkers with white fudge drizzle. These are so good. I tried one in the car as soon as I got out of. It was so good. I need to buy coffee though so I can dunk these in. Literally, I just finished. And then I bought some ground turkey because I'm going to make a goulash. bought some Italian grapefruit soda. This is basically sparkling grapefruit juice and I love it so much. I also bought dark chocolate covered espresso beans. It sounded really good. And I bought my favorite ice cream which is the coffee bean blast ice cream this is literally the best ice cream ever and then i bought this my favorite cheese it's the asiago cheese with rosemary and olive oil it's literally it's so good pretty much it for this trader Joe's haul it's mostly like junk food but i just have not been to trader joe's in like three months it feels like i think it's been like three months maybe it's been like two months yeah and i'm moving home and there is no trader joe's next to me i'm gonna put this away get something to drink because i'm so thirsty and play the sims because i have not played the sims in a long hey guys so as you can see I, I just went to the gym and i just got out of the shower can you see my red face Just kidding. Yeah, so now I'm just going to put on the Tasha Water Cream Moisturizer. I love this so much. This works so well with my dry skin and after the shower, it's the perfect moisturizer for my skin, honestly. I went to Sephora the other day and I had her check my skin color because I bought a new concealer to wear for my grad pictures because I don't want to wear foundation. And so she matched me, but I guess she was like, no, your skin is actually really nice. And I was like, thank you. So now I'm just going to let that sit on my face, let it soak it in. This Tasha cream soaks my skin when it's wet and it makes my skin feel so moisturized. Whoa. This is what happens when I take pre-workout. It gets makes my skin really red. Even when I do work out, my skin gets really red. And also, I had the shower on really hot. But now, after this, ow, I'm going to go to Target. I need to get razors, coffee, because I don't have any more. I'm literally out. Okay, so let's go to Target. And so while I'm at a red light, hello, red faced, I want to I want to talk about this lip balm that everyone raved about. Like all the beauty gurus, like Brooke Michio, Danielle Caroline. This chapstick is disgusting. Don't get it. Rosebud balm, and yeah, it smells like baby powder. So. FYI, I don't think anybody said that and plus it was seven dollars So it was more expensive than my aquifer one, which I was really annoyed with because I thought I would like it But yeah, this is not good at all, but I have to use it all because it's seven dollars So I'm keeping this in my car because that's where I see it every single day So I can use it up, but do not pick it up. That's all I'm saying. Wow, someone decided to leave a cart right next to my car are you kidding me this is horrible that's so rude speaking of that i'm a horrible person because record in the store but whatever i'm just going to record 30 dollars, which is great i bought some white rice because i'm going on the rice and bean diet that um dave ramsey da talks about for saving money I bought some soup. I bought two cans of chicken noodle soup. I bought two cans of red kidney beans. I bought my 
favorite creamer. It's the non-dairy vanilla creamer. The price went up on these. It's usually like $2.50, but now it's like $3.05 now. I'm mad. And then I decided to treat myself since I did get A's on two of my exams. I just bought a new Apple Watch strap, so I'm going to put that on. And then, last but not least, I decided to pick up a different coffee, and I'm really nervous, but I'm going to drink it all. It's the Tim Hortons original brand blend coffee. My first job was at Tim Hortons, so hopefully I actually like it. I didn't really drink coffee when I worked at Tim Hortons. This was way back in like 2014. I guess I'm just like a really slow learner and I just have like anxiety. My social anxiety gets the best of me when working, which is why I can't work retail or any like fast food service. So I have the white Apple Watch. If you guys have not seen that video, I will link it up in the info panel. Check that video out. It's really cool. I would love the support. Ugh. Man, that's hard. So basically you just, pr there are buttons on the back of the Apple Watch and it looks like this. The little mini buttons on the top and the bottom you press them and hold them down as you you hold the little skinny buttons down as you take the straps off i need to make sure i do this right oh wow that fit in real nice leave it to me to put it on backwards now let's try it i feel like my wrist got smaller from working out like i can put it on a farther on oh it's so pretty that's not what i want so this is what it looks like so now i'm gonna go home and <clears throat> either make red beans and rice or make soup. We'll see. This house, this house.